Hi guys, in this tutorial I will show you how to easily apply the Saber effect to an entire car in After Effects. Let's begin. As you already know, to apply the Saber effect, you first need to mask the object. But masking out an entire car using standard masking tools or even Mocha AE can take hours and is just not practical for this effect. But there is a simple trick you can use. Select the Roto Brush tool and double click on the car clip. Now carefully rotoscope the car as smoothly as possible, because if the selection is rough, the final result will not look clean. Once you are happy with the rotoscope, click the freeze button. After it's done freezing, close the rotoscoping window. Now that the car is isolated, we need to apply a mask to it. To do this quickly, go to layer and choose auto trace. Match the settings shown, click OK, and wait for the analysis to complete. Once the process is complete, you will see a mask around the car. However, auto trace may generate additional unwanted masks, like the one shown here. Make sure to double check and remove any unnecessary masks. Press M on your keyboard to reveal the masks, then simply delete the extra ones. Now that we have only the main mask remaining, we can apply the saber effect to the car. Also be sure to remove the roto brush effect from the layer, as it is no longer needed. Under the Saber effect, expand render settings and change the composite settings to add. Then expand customize core and set the core type to layer masks. And that's it. As you can see the Saber effect is now applied to the entire car. I will disable the mask visibility here to make the Saber easier to see. And from there we can begin adjusting it. Hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching and if you enjoyed it, please give it a like.